Hi everyone, welcome to Next22. I'm Vidya Shanmugam, Product Manager for BigQuery. In this session, we're going to talk about how you can manage your data silos and simplify your data analytics across multiple clouds. I have with me two of our valued customer speakers, Antoine Castex from L'Oreal and Luis Polanco from Accenture. Let's talk data. Over the last decade, we've seen a massive explosion in data, both in data types and volume. Data is also increasingly split across multiple storage systems, data warehouses, relational databases, object stores, etc. With the proliferation of new application, data is serving many new use cases, data sciences, BI analytics, streaming, and the list goes on. Data is also increasingly spread across multiple clouds. In fact, majority of the enterprises globally have data sitting in a mix of cloud platforms. With these emerging data trends, more and more customers are gravitating towards multi-cloud data leaks. There's also presence of customers with several challenges, such as data silos, data duplication, fragmented governance, complexity of tools, increased costs, and so on. Here is where Big Lake and Omni come in to help build and manage your data leaks across clouds at scale. We launched Big Lake General Availability earlier this year. Big Lake provides a standardized way across different storage formats, including BigQuery managed tables, blob stores, open file formats. Omni provides the compute engine with which you're able to access and query data in your AWS or Azure environments seamlessly using BigQuery UI. Omni and Big Lake together provide several key benefits. First, a single pane of glass to query your multi-cloud data leaks. Second, cross-cloud analytics by combining data across platforms. Third, unified governance and secure management of your data wherever it may be. Let's dig deeper into these benefits. BigQuery Omni provides a single unified view for your data across all of these clouds. It is serverless. We manage all of your infrastructure and hardware needs. We provide secure management of your data across AWS, Azure, and GCP. Let's see this with an example. Let's take a gaming company that has different titles and player data spread across S3, Azure Data Lake, BigQuery Managed Storage, and Google Storage. These are all separate data sources that are residing in different clouds. As you can see, all of these data sources are available to an analyst or data scientist in a single unified view. You can query any of this using BigQuery UI and familiar SQL language. You can also set access policies and tags and have consistent fine-grained governance across all of this data. It's great to access and query multi-cloud data through a single view, but we also know that you want to combine and integrate these data sets. We recently launched a capability called Cross-Cloud Transfer in Preview, with which you can first query the data that you want to join in AWS or Azure using Omni. This helps filter just relevant data sets. With the SQL load statement, then you can bring subset of that data into GCP as a managed table. You are now able to combine data across clouds with little egress costs. What more, this also dramatically reduces the time to insight as no wholesale migration of data is actually needed. With the cross-cloud data now being available in BigQuery, you can access it through Looker, Data Studio, other BI tools for all your advanced analytics needs. We're also building features for cross-cloud transformations. You can run an ad hoc query in AWS S3, perform local transformations, and create a table directly in the BigQuery region, all using SQL. With your data now available in BigQuery, you can join it with any other GCP data. We are continuing to invest heavily in the space, including capabilities such as cross-cloud materialized views. We know that seamless way to do cross-cloud analytics is very important to you. Lastly, I'm excited to share some features that provide unified and consistent governance of your data across clouds. Through Omni's integration with Data Catalog, you can discover, search your tables across clouds, add relevant business context with business glossary and rich text that's now available. You can also centrally manage access controls and policies at row and column level via big lake tables 
irrespective of where your data is. With future Dataplex integration, you will have the ability to manage these access policies at scale. Coming soon is also data lineage support with Dataplex integration. With this, you can track your data flow and dependencies of your data creation and transformations for big lake tables. Now that you've heard about some of the key benefits of Omni, let's talk about how you can get started. We have launched a new trial offer for Omni. With this, you can query your data in Omni regions using on-demand at no charge. There is no need to provision or purchase slots to run your Omni queries. This is a limited time offer until March 2023. We also now have Google Self-Based Labs to set up Omni. So don't wait to get started. With that, let's transition to Antoine to hear about how Omni is helping L'Oreal in their data challenges. Thank you, Vidya. And thank you for the invitation, for having me and L'Oreal behind me, the number one cosmetic company in the world. So before telling you why we are using Omni, let me tell you why BigQuery. And it is for one very simple reason. As you can see on my slide, we don't want to manage the infrastructure. Not at all. Be why? Because we are not an IT company. What do we prefer to do instead of, the, of that is focusing on the data that we put on BigQuery. The added value provided by this data is clearly more important for the L'Oreal people. Let me tell you the challenge that we have at L'Oreal, which is the biggest one, the acquisition of the different brand. And it happened, trust me, many, many times, and it will continue to happen in the future. So challenge is here. How is it a challenge and how we can do that before having Omni in the pocket? So before Omni, we were having almost three main challenges. One was the time to market delivery. It was very, very long and it was a big difficulty. The second was the diverse ecosystem we have to manage because of the different technology coming from different companies. And at the end, the complexity of the governance in terms of multiple technology, multiple languages, and securization of everything in one place. So the benefit of Omni in that story, they are very, very, very clear. The data can be hosted from all over the world, the place you want. The data can be queried very, very easily in one central place, and that prevents any duplication or moving the data. So it is better in terms of cost optimization, but also in terms of sustainability, which is very, very important for L'Oreal. So at the end, and probably the most important one, we keep a one and one only ways of working across all the developers that we have over the world. They use only one language, which is the SQL. So as a result of this deployment, what can we say? We can say that the result of that, this deployment, we made a benchmark to compare Omni versus the competitor of the market. And you can see on that slide that the performance are clearly better. Again, as I said before, having one way of working using SQL standard is, and I want to tell you again that it is very, very important for L'Oreal. The governance we can adopt because now everything is centralized in one place is also very important for us. And at the end, having an overview of everything in one single pane of glass was also a very, very big benefit of that. So to finish, I have a very quick example of the usage of BigQuery Omni, the cross-cloud analysis. Imagine L'Oreal wants to launch a new product. They want to compare data coming from, of course, the Google Analytics, telling me the sales, the audience, my customer, everything I, I need to know, and data coming from other companies. So now with Omni, I can aggregate this data in just one central place to have a very, very quick answer. So thank you, Vidya, for the invitation. Back to you. Thank you so much, Antoine, for talking to us about L'Oreal's acquisition challenges and how cross-cloud analytics is helpful for you. Now we'll hear from Louise about how Omni, Big Lake, and Dataplex are a key part of Accenture's data platform strategy. Thank you, Vidya, and thanks for having me here today. To get us started, let's take a look at Accenture as a company so we can understand our data complexity when we're running our businesses. Accenture is a global professional services that today has more than 700,000 people working all around the world. All these employees generate data and consume data while they are doing their work. As a global company, our technology direction is founded on a multi-cloud strategy. Cloud is automatically setting us up to take advantage of any data capability that core clouds providers are offering. 
Our employee is generated an amazing amount of data that it is distributed in a multi-cloud environment. And we use that data to empower our teams and leaders to make data-driven decisions. In my role at Accenture, I am part of the team responsible for empowering the people with the right data and with the right tools. The team is managing our global IT data platform that it is really unlocking the value of data innovation in the cloud. To deliver value with all this data at the scale, we adopted Google Cloud Platform as a service as the platform to host the business data that we have. Partnering with Google, we designed a data platform on GCP that can handle all the data requirements that we have in our global IT organization. Following the customer zero principle, we've been adapting and adopting new technologies, ensuring we were meeting our business security and technical requirements. And that is important for Accenture because we use ourselves later as a living example when we're helping our clients to do the same with these technologies. The platform provides ingestion, processing, storage, and security service and contains today more than 600 terabytes of business data. Our users are running more than 300 analytics applications using services like Composer, Dataflow, Dataflows, or Vertex AI. But as a multi cloud company, we know every cloud and every technology has its benefits when processing data. And we want to ensure all these benefits are available to our end users when they are generating value to the business. When you're offering your business in a multi-cloud environment, data is distributed across clouds, and that complicates the data management. Distributed management is one of the most common problems we see in our customers when they have data on multiple clouds. In this scenario, the number of data producers and consumers proliferates, and the domain complexity increases because Data is now required in multiple places and for different purposes, and all of that makes sense. The problem is that has that impact on your platform at the scale. You're increasing your data footprint because you're copying data multiple times across different clouds. You are probably, uh, you're paying data ingress processing or egress multiple times with different pricing models. Your data consolidation is now time and cost intensive, and the security model gets decentralized. You need multiple tools to manage it. And what it is even more important, now your people, require multi-cloud skills. Data scientists, power users, and data consumers in general have now to deal with different technologies to produce insights, making the job more complicated and probably less efficient. The focus is the data and how you can use that data for generating business benefits. And it is not the technology. Let, let me give you an example. In our global IT, we're running multiple research use cases where we want to simplify how we're connecting the data. Our data scientists are exploring data that it is distributed in different places across the cloud. They need agility when they are accessing the data and the ability to join this information across clouds. They need to understand how much value they can generate in the business even before we're moving the solution into production. But because data is spread in multiple places, our data scientists must wait for having this data available in the platform. In the meantime, we have our data architects that are literally stressed, preparing and moving this data and the business perceives that data projects are slow and probably they cannot resolve the problems on time. The key question is how can you simplify the data so the user experience is better than a multi-cloud scenario? We're looking for some kind of data virtualization that allows our data scientists to get into the data speed with the ability to connect this information during early stages of the project, but without having to wait for, without having to wait for all the data available in the platform. For these cases, BigQuery Omni seems a good match. Google and Accenture have been collaborating together for the last 12 months on BigQuery Omni using Accenture as customer zero. Together with Evolve Omni to support our enterprise needs. Following with example, data scientists are using dashboard and application for their exploration, and they need typically to consume from many different data sources. We want to speed up their data exploration use cases so their research can be executed early in time, but without moving the data. Today, we're moving all this data requiring one bulk export into the platform. Instead of having this big bang one shot approach, we're exploring BigQuery only as the tool to identify the right data sources, bringing the necessary data for analysis to do this incrementally. This helps deliver value immediately and lower the data management costs overall. We have seen a lot of power when combining Accenture industry expertise with Google innovative technologies. I think it's a win-win relationship that facilitates adapting these technologies to the enterprise using Accenture as customer zero. As we go deep in this view and collaboration, there are many new cases arising beyond Omni. We are working towards a better management model of data hosted in GCP using Dataplex. We're exploring how we can simplify the access and security on data store on files using BigLake. And we perceive there's a lot of power when mixing BigQuery, Omni, Dataplex, and BigLake together. 
So that's probably a brief summary of what we're doing at, at, with Google and Accenture to get in the data space. And as you can see, there is greatness when we're mixing Accenture innovative thinking with Google cutting edge products. That is a great energy collaboration that it's reverting directly into our customers in the digital journey. Vidya, back to you. Thank you so much, Louise and Antoine, for sharing with us how BigQuery Omni is a key part of your data strategy. You saw how Omni building together with Big Lake and Dataplex can help manage your multi-cloud data platform at scale. It provides several benefits, including a single pane of glass, cross-cloud analytics, and unified governance. Get started with your Omni on-demand trial now. Thank you, everyone, for tuning into Next22. Enjoy the show.